How can we get a real feel for just how far a light year is? Imagine cruising in a spaceship at the speed of light, zooming straight through the vacuum of space for about 365 days. That distance, that's exactly one light year, roughly 9.46607 trillion kilometers. Yep, a light year isn't just some time thing, it's like this insanely huge length unit compared to what us humans usually deal with. But just talking about it won't cut it. So hit upload on this vid and join me as we blast off from Earth. Dive deep into the solar system and get a way cooler sense of how crazy far a light year really is. Everyone knows light speed is about 3,000 kilometers per second the fastest thing in the known universe. That means your light speed ride could circle Earth in just one second flat. Flying to the moon only takes 1.3 seconds. So let's just say the moon's 1.3 light seconds away from Earth. Mars hangs out between 55 million and 400 million kilometers from Earth. That's one heck of a distance. So all Martian probes have to drift in space for ages to get there. Take China's Tianwen-1 launched in July 2020. It took a solid seven months to reach Mars. That's why moving to Mars isn't a walk in the park but a light-speed spaceship could get to Mars in just three minutes at its closest size. So Mars is roughly three light minutes away, not even close to a light year. Even Saturn, chilling about 1.5 billion kilometers away at the solar system's edge, would take only 1.4 hours at light speed. So Saturn's about 1.4 light hours from Earth. Meanwhile, the Cassini probe launched in October 1997 took nearly three years to get there. So yeah, it's no shocker that a light year feels crazy distant to us humans. Even the New Horizons spacecraft, speeding at a wicked 50,000 kilometers recordesis, took a full nine years to zoom past Pluto, which is about 5.5 light seconds from Earth on average. But if you want to truly grasp how far a light year is, the answer might just be on Voyager 1. It's the farthest man-made object ever from Earth. Launched back in 1977 after checking out several planets, Voyager 1 headed straight for the center of the galaxy. Right now, it's cruising at over 60,000 mythosotiolaris, but by 2024, after a whopping 46 years in space, it's only traveled 24.3 billion kilometers, not even a full light day. That's about 0.0025 light years. In other words, Voyager 1, the fastest ship humans built, still needs over 17,600 years to cross one full light year. So, you can imagine, a light year is just way out of our reach. And honestly, it's pointless for humans to spend tens of thousands of years trying to cross one light year. Because even if we did, we'd only just break out of the Oort cloud's edge. Q 
Keep in mind, the nearest star to our sun, Proxima Centauri, is 4.2 light years away. The Milky Way galaxy itself stretches at least 100,000 light years across. And there are billions more galaxies beyond that. So, from the vastness of interstellar space, a light year is both insanely far for us and tiny for the universe. Even though we're just a tiny speck, in the cosmic hood. Our spirit of exploring the unknown fills the entire universe way beyond a single light year. <laughs>